Hi guys, we just got a place to do our quarantine. It was tough to get here because Fabian was sick the last days. We were a long time without posting, but it was complicated because we are really busy on the search for this place and taking care of Fabian's health. But seeing this video, how was our journey since we were in Michoacan and to here where we are right now, Quintana Roo? Bye bye, nice important spot. Cheers. Cheers. And Vasculito, we are going to the hot springs. Yeah. morning time antibiotic for Fabian this is antibiotic this is a little for the pain in the neck and the body and there I have my sick boy <laughs> how are you feeling can you update the people about it I'm getting better after seven days taking antibiotics still not there I walk around the truck and I'm tired but it's gonna get there Good, great. I am sure it will. There is some cleaning. Not nice? No. Ay, ay, ay. We are parked here in this nice spot. This is a hot springs that they have here, but we could not really go to the hot springs because we don't want to risk that Fabian take the corona and then we will stay here and we are the last three days and tomorrow we want to move on to keep on traveling to a safe place and find a spot where we can stop the car and do our quarantine. Today we left this beautiful spot with the hot springs. We decided to fill, thank you, change, to fill our gas tank just in case we need gas in the next days. Most of the time we only fill the gas like twice a year. Uh, we have 40 liters gas only for cooking and for the oven. Then is yeah, more than enough. If we fill now, we will have for the next six months. So it is really good that we changed the Guzzle H2O. Uh, we use it a lot, obviously. We live in this truck. Look here. The filter took out a lot. Yeah. And oh, I wow. don't know. I think we change. Yeah, we do. Old one, new one. Nice. Big difference. This is Mexico in a quarantine. <laughs> Look at this. Oh my god, people stay home. Normal life in Mexico. It's like coronavirus don't exist here for them. They are pretty relaxed. Mm -hmm. stop to see if there's still some mariposas monarchas that is the butterflies that there is here a nice area where you can see them i hope it's not so many people up there we decided for i think the place that most of the time are empty
stopped with driving and we are, I think, five kilometers, Fabian, from the butterflies. Two kilometers. Two kilometers from the butterflies and we decided to stop here in this place. Look how nice. And we do a pause for food, little food. And tomorrow morning we will try to see the butterflies. And he's really nice because there is not a lot of people. No. I go out. I go out, Unicornia. Hi. Do you like this spot? Do you like this spot, happy girl? Yeah. is perfect nobody here exactly what we want hey hi we will start our hike it's 2.8 kilometers until the end Fabian think he is fit enough to walk that we just walk a little then let's see how it will be and let's hope for butterflies yay now we'll start the 300 meters elevation in this way we are now walk to the sanctuary and I do hope that up there is still butterflies enough to be like wow but they start to go back this time of the year I think to Canada Hi Pascalita Let's see Oh wow the butterfly Oh yeah Whew. There he is behind me my sick boy how are you feeling? It's okay. It's okay? Good. We hope to see some, but if we don't see, it is a nice place to hike. Welcome, Chinkua Mountain Sanctuary. Hibernation site of the monarch butterfly. Look at this tree, how gorgeous and the butterflies on the sky oh beautiful right now 11 o'clock is the time that they wake wake up then probably we will see more activity now Hello. hey you came so close i was shaking i was reborn Got another shot to make it to the top today. I'm pulling up the sutures. I'm ready for the future. I'm ready for the slings and arrows and the fortunes lost. And there's a voice that's buried deep inside my head. As it stumbled out, it's <laughs> and back to the car was not so many butterflies we tried but I think it's already too late I recommend anybody that's come here to take the horse ride or the guide because when you come there is a lot of different ways that you can take we managed to get to the end but Maybe with a guide, you'd be more interested to know a little about the story. But for the hike, it was cool and nice, necessary. And I hope that Fabian stay better. And yeah, to the car I want to go now. I'm hungry. Living in quarantine. Mm -hmm. With a raclette. Isabella. Swiss raclette. <laughs> Uh -huh. in the middle this, of nowhere this is the question what is the thing that you want to have in your truck when you are traveling ours is a raclette exactly <laughs> look 
the final luxury. result. Mm. Mm -hmm. Here too. Yum yummy. There you are. We have friends coming by. Our friend cow. You are sweet. You like to be pet. Huh? Look at her. Normally cows don't allow you to get close to them. But this one, she's really sweet. I think she's used to two humans. And it was really nice. We could take beautiful pictures together. This was pretty cool. She was eating my hair. And yeah, a lot of fun. This is our quarantine. Perfect spot to do a quarantine. What do you guys think? Look outside, Fabian! Look at that! This is cool! Unicorn here! Unicorn here! Hey, it's other dog food! And this is them bite! They share. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they also touch the glass and the dog food is gone. Parked. And look, every morning we had this view. What a beautiful place, huh? Amazing. Stay yeah. Away from Corona. Exactly. So nice. I think today we are going a little for water, empty toilets, and do those things. And then we will decide if we come back here or if we will go on to another beautiful spot. And uh, in Corona times, we found this beautiful spot to hide a little. Today, we're gonna test the first time our Guzzle HO stream, which allows us uh, to put water from here, from this little stream, directly in our truck, which is behind Isabella. So here we have our first filter, a carbon filter. Water comes in here. The pump is in here. It pumps it through this one first. Then it goes to our ultraviolet uh, filter and then it comes to the outlet which will fill our tank. We personally have the Guzzle H2O spigot which is the same system but inside our truck and then it goes to our spigot. Woohoo! So now this is the water that maybe was from last time, just let it out. Now look how high we are pumping. Nice. Fresh filtered water. On the tank. On the tank. Sebastian came. 
yeah. We have a friend that's camped because to... Because we were stuck on this highway, believe it or not. We can't get off here. Yeah, crazy. Oh my Oops. god. <laughs> oh my god. Look at that, how tight. <laughs> his whole family inside because it's really tough to drive in Mexico City and we needed to cross that to get to Puebla, Oaxaca and Yucatan Wow, big face uh, Probably here he is out This is the end From here we can go on To find it Take my hand Take a stand and I would never mind it. Sit and stare. So hey guys, so here's what happens. Parked in front of our lovely Walmart here, Tabasco, uh, which is on the Caribbean side. You can see on me how sweaty I am. We drove yesterday nine hours uh, here. Um, we don't know if we did the right thing or not. But anyways, we have to drive 10 hours, 10 hours. Tomorrow the government in Mexico will say new uh, uh, restrictions. Um, so we will figure everything out. Let's hope it was a wise decision to go all the way to Yucatan. It's the end of Chiapas and it starts Tabasco. Again? Yeah. Back to Tabasco. I'm Basco. Back to Tabasco. <laughs> <laughs> Long day today for the doggies. We left 9 o'clock I think in the morning and we are driving now is 1 or 2 already. Whole day driving because we want to get to Yucatan as soon as possible. Just a quick update, we are here in Merida. It has 39 degrees. We made it to Yucatan, but we finally took a decision. Thanks to Liliana, we found a nice place. And you're gonna see that we have another four and a half hours drive today. We're gonna stock up and then we have a quarantine place. And yeah, let's see the surprise where we're gonna end up. You will love it. See you when we see it. Finally found our place to 
do this quarantine and we got we had a lot of driving you probably saw in this video if not you will see this and we are in Quintana Roo it's very crazy and we have a house in Puerto Morelos I think it's the name and we will be there in a beautiful house we will enjoy this next one or two months there with family in a home for Chandelier for a while <laughs> until we can go back on the roads and enjoy our trip then yeah let's hope that we can bring a lot of entertainment for you guys because we will have a lot of time in a house to do that there it is this is our new home sweet home thanks to Liliana to give us a so such a good deal on the house yeah there is Frank the tank and it's perfect because we can clean the car we can fix things then we will be busy I hope that all of you are healthy and good and if you are sick that you get better soon yeah and please stay safe then I hope you enjoyed this video if you do enjoy give us a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to our channel have a nice quarantine time Amen. write to us if you want us to see something special that we can show you right now write us in the comments <laughs> thank you guys bye bye a unicorn what is this huh yeah i don't know but it's looking interesting i like that box with noise i only want to go inside the water too